What is up guys? Welcome back to another video. In this video, I'm going to show you how you can scrape jobs from LinkedIn using Appify and Make.com. Let's get started. After creating an account, click on Appify store and you'll be taken on this page right here. So Appify is an incredible tool with pre-built actors that you can use to scrape any website or automate projects. I'll search for the website that we'd like to scrape. In this case, I like to scrape LinkedIn, so I'm going to search for LinkedIn. You can see over 100 tools that you can use to perform a particular task. So if you like to scrape LinkedIn jobs, you can use this tool right here. If you like to scrape LinkedIn posts, profiles, sales navigator, comments, ads, post information, you can use any of these tools right here. You can even scrape employees of a particular company just by using this tool right here. But in this case, we like to scrape LinkedIn jobs. So I'm going to click on LinkedIn job scraper. Here, we can define the kind of jobs that we're looking for. So yeah, we can add the title for a job. For example, we can say automation specialist is our job title. You can choose the location of the job. In this case, we can say United States. You can add the company name right here and the company ID if you want to. You can also choose the published ad. You can either say anytime, past month, past week or past 24 hours. You can add the total number of rows. You can say 20. For on-site or remote, you can select either on-site, remote or hybrid. For the job title, you can choose full-time, part-time, contract, temporary, internship or volunteer. And then for the experience level, you can either choose internship, entry level, associate, mid-senior mid level or director. But I'm only going to choose the full-time job, add the total number of rows and then choose the title of the job and the location of the job. I'll click on save and start. Here, you'll see that our tool is running. So you can see right here, our tool just successfully scraped automation specialist jobs, getting all the jobs that involve automation from the United States. So we're getting the title of the job, the location, the posted time, the published ad, the job URL, the company name, the company URL, the job description, the application counts, employment type, seniority level, job function, industry, company ID, and the apply URL right here. Using this tool, we just scraped a specific job from a specific location. Now, we can set up an automation on make.com that scrapes these LinkedIn jobs for us automatically. So to do that, on make, I've created this scenario and renamed it to scraping jobs on LinkedIn using Appify and make.com. Now to set up the automation here, I'll search for Appify, then click on Appify. Then here, I'll click on run an actor. Here, you'll need to create a connection between Appify and make.com just by clicking on add and then renaming your connection and adding your API token. To get your token, click on settings right here. Click on API and integration. Then you'll find your personal API token right here. So all you have to do is just copy it. Then on make, just come and paste your API token over here. And then click on save. But since I had already created a connection, I'm going to close and then choose the right connection over here. For our actor, I'm going to choose LinkedIn Job Scraper as our actor. Here, I'm going to choose to run synchronously. And then here, we'll need to add our JSON. I'll click back to our Octo. Then here, where it says manual and JSON, click on JSON. And then you'll need to copy this JSON right here. So copy it. Now, on JSON formatter here, I'll paste our JSON. And now, to format our JSON, I'm going to click on process. And then copy the JSON. And then back to automation, I'll paste our JSON right here. And then click on OK. This module will only run our actor. Now to get the data, I'll add another module on Appify called get dataset item. Here, for the dataset ID, I'll add the default dataset ID. Then here we can choose the limit, you can say 10, then click on OK. Now to scrape jobs from LinkedIn on make, I'll run our automation. Automation ran successfully. And here we're getting the jobs that we just scraped from LinkedIn. So here we are getting the title of the job, the job URL, the company URL, 
the number of applicants, the, the time it was posted. We're also getting the description over here of the job, the contract type, the experience level, the work type, the sector, the apply URL. So with this simple automation, we are scraping jobs from LinkedIn using a specific title or keyword. Now we can choose to add all these jobs that we just created from LinkedIn using this automation to a Google spreadsheet. I have this Google spreadsheet that I've renamed to scraping sheet. Here's where we're going to add our jobs. Now here we have a column called title, job URL, company URL, posted time, application time, contract type, experience level, and apply URL, where we are going to input the data that we scrape from LinkedIn using Appify. We're going to add that data right here. Automation. I'll search for Google Sheet. Here, I'll click on add a row module. I'm going to choose our spreadsheet. Our spreadsheet is called scraping sheet. Our sheet name is, well, is called LinkedIn Jobs. Then here we can add the values to our column. So for the title, I'm going to add the title of the job right here. For the job URL, I'm going to add the job URL. Company URL, I'm going to add the company URL. The posted time, we can add the posted time right here. Application count, we can add the application count right here. Contract type, we can add the contract type over here. Experience level, we can add the experience level over here. And the apply URL, we can add the apply URL over here. And click on OK. Now here, we can choose to scrape a different job with a different title. This time around, we can say web designer. We like to scrape only 10 jobs, then click on OK. So here we can, we can leave it as 10, then click on OK. Now to scrape web designer jobs in United States, I'll run our automation. we ran our job, our LinkedIn job scraper tool, and we got all the web designer jobs in the United States. So we got a total of eight jobs, and we added the eight jobs to our Google spreadsheet. So here, we'll need to first of all format our Google spreadsheet. This is our web designer jobs, and this is the job URL. And this is the company URL that posted the job. And then we also have adding the posted time, the application count, the contract type, the experience level, and the apply URL to that specific job. We are scraping all these LinkedIn jobs by setting up the simple automation on make.com. And then we are adding the jobs to our Google spreadsheet over here. Instead of manually adding the job title to our automation, we can add a we can add a watch row module to automation right here. So here on Google Sheets, I'll search for watch new rows and we'll use this as our trigger. And then we can connect automation right here. Now, on our scraping sheet, I've added a new sheet and this here is where we are going to add the job titles that we like to scrape. In our case here, we can add copywriting. For example, we wanted to scrape a copywriting job yeah, we're going to find the specific spreadsheet and our sheet name. Our sheet name is going to be job titles. We can limit it to one or two, say one in our case, then click on OK. Here we can say all and click on OK. And now here, instead of adding the title manually, we can add our job title over here and then click on OK. So if you like to scrape copywriting jobs, we'll run automation right here. can see that we got our title which is copywriting yeah we ran our LinkedIn job scraper on Appify and succeeded in scraping copywriting jobs and then here we got all the copywriting jobs that have been posted on LinkedIn right here so we are getting a total of 10 jobs then we are adding the 10 jobs to our Google spreadsheet right here now when I open my Google spreadsheet yeah we can that arrow above so we can separate the two jobs that we scraped earlier so here we are getting all the copywriting jobs that have been posted on linkedin and we are getting the title the job url the company url the posted time the application count the contract type 
the experience level, and the link to apply for the jobs. And we are scraping all this data using this simple automation that we just set up right here on make.com. Yeah, we can rename this module to job title. Title. And then here, we can rename this to LinkedIn jobs. So we just scraped from our LinkedIn job scraper tool on Amplify. This is a simple automation that you can set up right now to scrape LinkedIn jobs using Appify and make.com. If you have an automation or a system in mind that you'd like for me to create, just comment down below in the comment section. I read all the comments, and if I land on your comment and I find it intriguing, I'll come back on a future video showing you how to set up the entire automation from scratch. But for now, thank you for watching, and I'll see you in the next video. Goodbye.